to our episode of Super Reaction Bros. I'm Chris. I'm and Christopher. And we're taking it, today's episode. We're taking a look at the final trailer for the live-action Bleach movie coming out in Japan. Yes. Now, not gonna go over any pretty much a lot. Um, we're just gonna go. We're just main, go over what we saw in the based, last trailer. Based on a very popular manga series by Tite Kubo. I hope the guy didn't butcher that. And essentially about like Grim Reapers fighting monsters. Yeah, that's about it. That's, that's like, a blunt. If you want to see it, more. <laughs> more of our reaction, or more of his description, check out our last yeah. two videos. Yeah, pretty much this world's equivalent of Grim Reapers fighting evil monsters from their equivalent of hell. Short, simple to the point. Alright, let's get this going and see what new stuff we may possibly see or, or hear in this. So, here we go for Bleach, the final trailer for the Japanese manga live action movie. That's one long do you word. really need to say all of that? Yes, I do. So, here we go. Mention Friday. Friday. Just oh, let you people okay. know. Oh, That'd be cool Friday. if all of them did that. It was like it's like Avengers were like April twenty seventh. Wait, when's that? Friday. Friday. <gasps> oh, because it's America. Sometimes they do it like Thursday, late Thursday night, pretty much. You know, midnight releases or just yeah. Thursday night itself. That's when they open. Yeah. Up. Um. Yeah. I can. I'll probably explain a little bit. Like his his mother mysteriously died when trying to save a girl near the edge of like a ri uh, like a riverside. Oh, okay. Uh, it's later he finds out it was a hollow. So, um, yeah, it looks good. It looks um, good. Yeah. I look. I I never have a problem when like, okay, let, let, how's the best way to put it? When they do Avengers movies, I don't mind them doing it because it comes directly from the country that did it. That did it. And so got... when it comes to the, the live action stuff, like Bleach, like this Bleach live action movie, that's why I like. It's how, coming from Japan. I like how Warner Brothers is diving into that because it's like. They want, it's like, they don't want something cheesy. They want something where it's like, it's literally like that film looking type of, you know, yeah. live action film, but still it has what people want pretty much, yeah. you know, Japanese actors and all that in there yeah. put into it. So it's really awesome. I love, again, they're doing a great job with the, the effects that they're working with, but still sticking with the story that they're working with as well. Yeah. Um, like I said, the weird guy with the, the thing on the string, that's, that's like Rukia's like he's like the pretty much he he's like Rukia's yeah. um older brother um but not like blood really like adopted like more of like okay yeah like, she was adopted okay. um it's one of those things like in Avengers is like she's adopted and it's like but like it visually it looks good yeah. the sword actually looks fun as a matter of fact how people forget how big Ichigo's sword starts out it's fucking so huge. I wonder if I seeing like behind the scenes of how they did a lot of those fight scenes especially with the big huge ass swords oh, oh yeah sword play yeah. I wouldn't mind it's seeing, Japan like, I think they know how to use a sword well I know that but I'm just saying for no, I know, I'm, how I'm they did a lot of it pretty much because it looks really good I yeah honestly I wouldn't mind checking this out I, same here I've I'm sad that they ended the series the way they did but hopefully um knock on wood if they um 
if this does well enough, hopefully they can do like some OVAs or stuff to wrap off the series in general. Like one last good run, last good run to, ra yeah. to, to wrap it up the yeah, right way. Yeah, because I already brought this to you. The ending was kind of rushed. Um, yeah. The final guy, the final bad guy was being like two chapters. The yeah, final bad guy was being two chapters. Like maybe this gives him a, then, this gives him a chance just to do one last run at least to do it the right way. Hopefully, because so. like even the epilogue was like, here's what happened to like. 80% of everybody. Well, what about the other 20%? Eh, can't help you there. You know, yeah, that's why it came out. That's what I said. Hopefully this does well. Hopefully they, they give them the idea to do, either do another whole good, another good uh, long run uh, for it, or at least one more run for it, just yeah. to wrap it up the but, right way. But I would say, anybody trying to get into the series, I would say stick to the manga. Um, if you want to watch anime, go ahead. Just warn there are big filler segments in between yeah. certain moments. Like, the first, the first filler arc it had was fine. I, but after that is where it was obvious that they were just like, this was shoehorning in to stretch out them still having to work on the like actual main story arcs and stuff like that. Yeah. But I thought the anime series was good, but it does end, it does end Abruptly. different, no, differently oh, from yeah. the manga because it, it just ended. It's just like, yeah. after like the second to last arc, it just ends. That's it. And if you want the finale, you have to read the manga. Yeah, so... And it got the family got rushed and it sucks. I know a lot of people fans out there they know it sucks because it got rushed. Hopefully, if this does well enough, you know, people will take more interest into making more Bleach. I'm hoping like even like Kubo San, yeah, does you know looks into watching how it does does and try to push to like finish up the series where animated or just a bit more for in manga form. Yeah. I'm sorry I went off the tangent there, but since I can't, I'm not really going to talk about the lore for you about you because you already know about the lore. I just wanted to get that part of the way. Yeah. And I can't wait for the live action movie. So other than that, if you're new to the channel, you hit the like button. If you want to talk some more about stuff like this, comment down below. If you want to share this around, share it around. And if you like it's just a little bit more than anybody else when it comes to talking about adaptations. Hit the subscribe button down below and hit that bell icon as well. Let us know what you guys thought of this uh, reaction. Oh, uh, uh, not, uh, not reaction, but you know what I mean. Uh, of this trailer, final trailer. Um, this is giving get you more even pumped up to walk, go watch this and take a look at it. Especially if you're a fan of it. If you you know grew up th with this. Either way, you know, let us know what your guys' thoughts are. We'd love to hear your guys' opinions about this. Um, put your thoughts down of our reaction overall. Mainly his specifically, pretty much diving into it. Uh, you know, whether he was right or not, of course, he would always apologize for yeah, it. Yeah, he can correct my ass. I haven't, I haven't read or watched any Bleach-related stuff besides this in, like, fucking forever. So, mm -hmm. let's, let us know in the comments below what you thought of it. Put down what you thought of our reaction overall. But most importantly, thank you for watching. So, until next time, I'm Chris. I'm um, Christopher. And this has been a very strawberry-filled episode of SRB. See ya! Later. Hey guys, thanks for watching. If you want to check out your previous reactions, as well as our other shows, click the playlist down below. And if you want to check us out in the social universe, you can check us out on Twitter, as well as Stardust, at Super React Bros.